of this Owen Sound final. Slater to shoot first in round three. Gets off to a good start. Nice shot from Gautier. This is the first NCAA tournament final that Louis Gautier has made. Fred Slater's been in quite a few. The last singles final that Fred Slater was in was in London of 2013, where he defeated John Conrad in that final. Gautier is looking for his first tournament title. See what he can do with this shot. end up losing one of his own discs and leaving a bit of a hanger here for Fred Slater. Slater makes it. But Gautier keeps the pressure right on. They're tied 2-2. Gautier has the hammer advantage. So Slater's going to need to try to make another 20 here before this round is done. Gautier already up 4 nothing. needs one more point in this round or the next one, and he will clinch a victory for Game 2. Nice try from Fred Slater. At least he's moved the disc now to his half of the 20 hole, which makes scoring 20s a little bit easier, but that is a great shot from Louis Gautier. Takes the white disc out, brings his disc all the way to the 5. It's not easy. Fred Slater's going to have to peel this one off because there's no way he can bring that one back into the 15. So last... So second last shot for Louis Gautier. He makes a 20. He goes up one. Last shot for Fred Slater. He makes it. So now Gautier just has to put his disc in the house. And... He will win this round. In fact, he's already clinched the tie, so in effect, he's already won this game. But just for thoroughness, he does take the two points for this round and wins game two by a score of 6 nothing. So Louis Gauthier with a win and a tie so far in the first two games. If he can get as much as a tie in this third game, so as much as three points... He will win the Owen Sound title. Fred Slater must win this game to force extra rounds. So Gautier shot first. Slater has a hammer in this first round. Slater's down a 20. He'll be looking to make one here. mistake for Fred Slater. He usually doesn't miss those. Chance for Gautier. Might try a little bit of ricochet and a little bit of tap off his own disc. And he went for it. So another opportunity for Slater now. The hanger is still there. Oh, and he makes it this time. Good shot there. Tied 120 each. Tough shot for Gautier. Fred Slater might be looking at making a double takeout of both these white discs. Gets the one. Leaves his own disc far back. It's not an opportunity where Louis Gauthier could double off the two black discs or even really score a 20 off it. So he's certainly in a tough spot. Maybe Slater will try a double takeout now. Nice shot from Fred Slater, but he leaves it pretty close to the 20 hole. He leaves a hanger. He's not too happy about that. Chance for Gautier. He makes it with a good shot. Fred Slater, though, can really put the pressure on if he scores a 20 here. But he does. Great shot from him. Two shots left for both players. 
was a good takeout from Gauthier, but I think he needed to peel that one off because we're on to the last shots now. So Fred Slater just needs an easy takeout here, which he gets. So Fred Slater, that's exactly what I needed there. He had the hammer in that round, and he wins the two points, and he starts off shooting for the second round, missing the 20 a little bit long. That was a big round for Fred Slater to get. He needs at least five points in this third game. So it was crucial that he won that first round in which he had the hammer advantage. When you're in a position that you know you need to win the game, you're really hoping to win the two rounds in which you have the hammer and try to squeak out one point in one of the other rounds. Slater's trying to do that in this round. Gautier likes the positioning right now. <laughs> what a great shot from Louis Gautier. Makes the short ricochet. He has the hammer advantage, and now he's up a 20. Slater scores. On Gautier misses short. Chance for Slater. He makes it. The pressure's on Gautier now. He had the lead in this round. Just let it slip a little bit. That's a good shot from Gautier. Tied 2-2. Four shots left for both players in this round. A crucial round now. If Slater's looking to steal any points against the Hammer, he would really love it to come here. He has an opportunity. Good shooting from both players. Three shots now left for both. Slater can just do his best to keep scoring 20s. Another one he makes there. He will get at least one point in this round. 4-4 four, four now in the 20s. Two shots left for both players. And Slater misses long. Good takeout from Gautier. So Fred Slater, pretty tough shot. He has to take this white disc off and make a 20. Otherwise, he'll leave it up to Gautier. Oh, and he can't get the takeout. So Gautier just has to make contact with this black disc, which he does. So Louis Gautier wins the second round, and we are tied 2-2 in this third game.